All right, Mr. Deadman here of the Dead Man Stone Podcast, a live show every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday night at 9 30. All right, I want to react to Baby Metal, Give Me Chocolate, but I want to do something a little bit different. I want to show you with a live performance what they were then and to show you their latest live performance. Because, I mean, Baby Metal is a band that's going through some growing pains right now, and I hope they come through it. I really do. But, I don't want to just tell you about it. I want you to see it for yourself. Okay. Let's play this. This is Gimme Chocolate. I think this was in 2016, I believe. A live performance with a commie band, which you can see in the background. And they are playing. <laughs> The comic man, they, they play, they play their instruments. I like their cutesy dance. <sighs> so here you got the three girls, right? Sue, Sue Metal, Yuri Metal, Moa Metal. It's so, it's so cutesy, I like it. It's so sweet, you know? And addictive. A chocolate. You want a piece of chocolate? <laughs> uh, I'd be like, yes please. I'll take a piece of chocolate. When I first heard this, I was like, are they trying to get chocolate from the devil? The give me, give me. Give me a piece of chocolate. I like how the three work well. I mean, they seem to work well together. I'll, I'll get into that. <laughs> there are things I want to say. I'll say during the next video. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. Working the crowd. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Y'all go run around. I swear that contrast, the useful, just chipper, uh, energetic, friendly, cutesy, sweet voices in the metal. Give me, give me. Creates a very addictive contrast. You say it, sister. Chocolate. Chocolate. I can't do the dance routine yet. And I've listened to this a lot. This is not a first reaction. I think you guys already know that. If you were to tell me that there was gonna be a metal band and they're gonna have like I think these girls are like 16 uh, okay this one this is their latest uh, performance. Of course, I say this at 2019. I think this performance was in 2018. Uh, live Rock AM Ring uh, 2018. You're gonna see. <clears throat> you're gonna see something. 
Here we go. Kiss me. All right, right there. They, have, if you don't know, they don't appear, doesn't appear to be a problem, but they're missing a member. One's been replaced with a, with a whoever. Uh, you have um, Sue, still, and you have Moa, but you don't have Yuri. Yuri left. She's, she's doing her own thing. Um, she claims it was due to like health problems and whatever, and wanted to do a solo career, I guess, but. It's, I don't know, like, and I like David Metal. Don't get me wrong. Guys, I support this band. And I want to see what they do with this. But they also lost, the comedy band lost their guitarist. He, he, he died. And not any, brownies in the field, brownies in the crowd. You can drop those brownies. You could drop them. All right, here we go. Kung Fu Metal. The outfits are different. I'm going for more like a ninja thing now, I guess. But they still have the, the cutesy dance. This thing. And that. But notice that Moa Metal is now doing the uh, the vocals of two. And that right there is a guitarist that passed away. It's still a catchy song, and they still sound great live. I just, I hope they get to the growing pains. See, it's kind of weird. Because what she's supposed to be doing right there is supposed to be two. Uh, two girls. It just like doing that dance and pointing at Sue. Because Sue's supposed to be like... Like pouty face. Pouty face stare. It, that routine doesn't work. I mean, if you could have the backup dancer, have the backup dancer do the part. Like charging up a, an attack, just push it out, push it out. You get your solo. Yeah, for those who say they're not a metal band. There's definitely a band playing metal. I mean, you might not like that they have girls singing, but I mean, come on. And I say that knowing that in the past, like when they first started out, it was pre-recorded music, but it's not that way anymore. They have a pretty big crowd. No, even 
is it just me or, or does it seem like some of the people in the crowd seem like something's missing? Oh, look at that mosh pit. Chocolate, the chocolate. I want some chocolate now. All right, that was good. Let me know in the comments section what you think the future is for this band. Uh, I know people say that uh, Yuri is replaceable. Uh, just about anyone can be replaceable. But you got to find the right chemistry. And maybe there's some uh, backroom drama. <laughs> maybe there's some problems. But and maybe they don't need three. Maybe they can make it work with two. But... I mean, that routine seems kind of weird live. And there's other ones, other songs. I mean, the, think about it. These songs are written with two uh, backup, dan uh, not backup vocals and one lead vocal uh, in mind. So, it seems, seems weird. But with that said, their latest stuff, Distortion and Starlight, that sounds great and it looks cool. The problem is, and the reason why I haven't reacted to the music videos, is that, and maybe it's just me, but I don't really care for music videos. That tr like, like The music videos I like are the ones where you see the band playing, you see the group performing, that's cool. But the ones where they try to be like a movie, try to be cinematic, uh, it's like, oh, okay, well... You try, but it, to me, it just comes across as like a video game cutscene that I want to skip. And that sounds wrong, maybe. It sounds kind of mean for the amount of money and effort they put into it. And I'm talking about the the music videos of like uh, Distortion and Starlight. But the songs are great. And um, what I'll do is when they perform the next live performance, I definitely want to react to. Hell, maybe next time they start touring actually go that would be something that will be amazing anyway let me know in the comment section what you think about baby metal what you think their future is and thumbs up if you like this you know if i said anything you don't agree with don't thumbs down man just let me know in the comment section we could talk about it i do that anyway with that said take it easy